The Bible tells us of Jesus praying on many occasions. There are incidents where he prayed alone. There are incidents where he prayed in the presence of his disciples. And he prayed before the masses. But let it be reiterated that Jesus was a man of prayer. I would also inform you that Jesus wants his children. That's us, isn't it? Jesus wants his children to be people of prayer. Early in his ministry, in his marvelous Sermon on the Mount, where Jesus touched on a variety of subjects, and taught in depth about many issues. One of the things that Jesus taught about in his great Sermon on the Mount was this matter of prayer. He taught the people how to pray. And it is this version of what we call the Lord's Prayer that we commonly use when we pray the Lord's Prayer. It is not the Luke's version, but the Matthew version that we use. And I would like for us to take just a moment now and bow our heads and together aloud Pray the Lord's Prayer. Could we do that? Shall we bow our heads and pray together? Our Father, which art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done in earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Amen. That is a sample prayer that Jesus used in teaching his disciples how to to pray. Let me state further that the art of praying does not come naturally. It requires patience and practice and persistence. If we interpret the scriptures correctly, praying is an art that must be learned.